Bonnet? Flying your own flag at last? Yes. Yes, Blackbeard cut me loose, sadly. Time to have a go at this myself. Well, that's grand. Yes, it's for the best, I think. I should have some wild stories when next we meet. Edward! Your constant friendship has been my most treasured find on these seas. Well above gold and silver and rum, I, I prize the courage you have inspired in me this year. Thank you, sir! A fair good morrow to you! By your wives, their families, and countrymen. How else to explain your government's complete disinterest in your well-being? Hostages for nonsense. These were my only terms. Charleston can see this mess. It's the idea. Out of range, but well in sight. So where's the medicine? We sent a party ashore to partner with the governor. That were a week ago. No noise, he says. I'll handle it. Give me a day. There's movement up ahead. Is it soldiers? I am in something of a hurry. I propose we follow, else they spring something we ain't ready for. What's your thinking? Blackbeard's been at this eight days already. So it's a good bet. Someone out there has prepared the medicines, just in case. Ah, but they're stalling, thinking up ways to avoid paying it out. Aye, so let's find where they've gathered and hope for the best. More sail, all we've got. Careful, Captain. We're drifting close to a watchtower. Another watchtower. Two up, short and safe. Keep her at half sail, Captain. Speed will do us no favors here. Use the stunts. Careful with the banks. You cannot pass them undetected, Captain. And there is no other way. There's always another way. 
All stop. See them over there. Let us hope the river remains this wide. This ship's built for the open ocean, not stuck in bikes. Clue up, so the same. If we run aground here, we may never get out. Use the mains. Be sure they don't spy us trailing them. Steady as she goes, Captain. They're getting away, Captain. Then I'll have to go on without her. I'll be back with the medicines. Aye, sir. Syphilis and scurvy, no doubt. What noxious coffins these pirate ships must be. Until you showed up. Go on then. Captain's waiting. Oh, 
Almost there. Good. Captain Wyatt is not a patient man. Hello! Is that Raider yonder? The very same. Then speed along. You're expected. And you know how... Oh, Christ! It took him! It took him! I told you! Just throw! For God's sake, throw! I told you there was something, didn't I tell you? Oh, God. Let's just get out of here. It was an accident. Private Simon! This, this crocodile! I don't care about your accidents. What's the word from the harbor, soldier? Speak. No change, sir. They're holding fast, but are yet to kill or maim any of the captives, near as we can tell. Perhaps it's time to... To surrender? I've been entrusted with the affairs of the town. To surrender? I've been entrusted with the affairs of the town, and I do not intend to bow to the demands of a pirate, no matter how fierce his reputation. Yes, sir. As long as the supply key is with me, no man shall touch that medicine. May plague and calamity strike them all. Bloody idiot. What? Pirates! The ship's here! Pirates! Fall back to the mansion! Blackbeard made you as good an offer as ever a man got from any pirate. You might curse his methods, but medicine was all he wanted. And now he'll get it. You should have bartered, mate. He has returned, Captain! What's the take? Two crates. And the means for mixing additional doses. Ah, uh, that's right thinking. Precious little of that these days. You hear that, Mr. Rax? My young friend returns with offerings and so saves your scrawny neck. Will you not thank him? You should quit these waters, Thatch. The governor, he's bound to muster more soldiers. You go on ahead. I, I got some business in the north. You're done, aren't you? Giving up on us. On NASA. Look, lad. I'm late into my fourth decade on this earth. And if I don't find some means to make the fifth quiet and cozy voyage, I'd rather sink to the devil's doorstep than call myself captain. Another year. We'll meet again, lad. In this world. Or the one below.
Do you have a minute? I'm on my way upstairs. IDVA wanted to talk with us about putting together a trailer using some of the footage you've been recording this past month. Take your time. I'll meet you by the elevator. Over here. Are you ready? He's waiting for us. I just watched some of your footage from this week. It's amazing. Blackbeard was mental. And we all got so excited that we started talking about this idea for a trailer about him. Maybe start with him drinking, talking to some pirates, telling a story. Then we cut to him leaping across the deck of his boat and, sorry, his ship, not boat, but jumping around the deck of his ship, swinging from ropes and fighting like a devil. I mean, obviously, we're gonna have to manipulate some of the existing footage to get it looking good, but it could be great. I'm getting a shiver in my timbers just thinking about it. <laughs> Sorry. Bonjour, ça va? I hope we're not late. No, you can go right. Hi, Melanie, I saw you just walked in. I need a few minutes with you alone. Let's see is on the phone and we're discussing the Kenway project. Oh, yes, of course. Sorry about this. I'll call you when we're ready. Shouldn't be long. Hello? Hello? Do you have a second? Of course you do. Head to the waypoint on your map. I have another job for you. I'd like to link all the cameras in the building to a central monitoring system, but most aren't calibrated correctly. Another locked door. Not a problem. Voila! You now have level 2 security clearance. Not bad for your first few weeks. Find the camera control station first. I'll update your communicator. Oh, this is an interesting security measure. It looks like you need to find the right combination of numbers to adjust the wave. Easy enough, right? Pick a number selector, then change its value. Once you find the right combination of numbers, you should get access. I'm sorry if that came up wrong. We are not trying to be a bottleneck here, but we just don't have the resources right now to do two times the research. Finding that balance is your priority. Your entertainment products are simply a means to pay the bills for larger and more important work. That's the way the world works. Hmm? Dirty money buys clean hospitals. You get it? We're on board, Letitia, rest assured. We have our best employee working on this, but it will take time. That means you. Good. And thank you. The both of you. I look forward to seeing what you deliver. Until then, I'll see you at the shareholders meeting, Olivier. Looking forward to it. 
Bye bye. Tabarnak! It's a little too early for that kind of abuse, huh? Come on. So, what's next? We do as the lady says. Focus on the observatory. Assassin, Templars, crazy talk. I'm curious about this shareholders meeting, though. How about you break into Olivier's office and see if you can find his schedule? Oh, what? You don't like that idea? Well, how about I blow the fucking whistle on you, hacker? I own you! <laughs> what I mean is, I don't want to ruin your life. So, do as I say. Now, step over to the window. can't waltz into Olivier's office through the front door, so I've opened another route. Up we go. Did he know that Abstergo was run by Templars? Oh, yeah. Sounds like crackpot stuff, I know. But then again, the moon landing was fake, right? So, anything's possible. All right. Either you walk through that door or throw yourself off the terrace. Those are your options. Well done, kiddo. Find his computer. Make it snappy. We're looking for the shareholders' meeting schedule. It's worth a lot of money to us. through and through, ain't ya? Now, get down to the lobby. There's a courier waiting. Yeah, that's right. I've been planning this for a few hours. Now, wait. The receptionist. Hold on. I'll try something. Thank <laughs> you. 
As gullible as ever. Now, hurry down to the lobby before I remotely detonate your earpiece. <laughs> Don't even think about ratting me out. My tracks are covered. Yours ain't. I think you pulled it a little too long. Oh, come on! It's not encrypted code, for God's sakes. It's just a bloody coffee. Oh, hooray! It's our old friend. Hey there! I just got a call about picking up another transfer. Oh? You said you were here to see me. Yes, that is one of the perks. Let's see it. Hmm. A conference in Chicago. Very nice. Thanks for this. We'll be in touch. Ciao, Rebecca. Text me. Stuff it, Hastings. Well done, friend. Very well done. Apologies for my temper tantrum there. You are with the good guys, I promise. We'll keep you safe. Trust me. Go on back to work. We'll be in touch.